Welcome to step-by-step -step tutorial of how to install any control on Android devices. In this tutorial, we have used Honor Smartphone with Android 12 operating system. The installation instructions are almost the same for all devices. However, we have prepared instructions for installing any control on other devices and in different languages. To check more tutorial videos, refer to the application installation tutorial section. Now let's start. Since monitoring applications cannot be published in Google Play Store, first you need to go to Settings and turn off Google Play Protect, so that you don't get into any trouble during the installation and prevent disabling of the app. Now you need to transfer the application file to the target device and install it. Here I have used the direct download link which is anacontrol.net. Open the link in your target device browser and tap on download. You can use other methods as well, such as sending the file via chatting apps or using a cable to transfer it from your computer to the device, and then install it directly from the file manager. Since the application requires a variety of special accesses to generate all the logs, it may be identified as a risky application by the device's security system. If you encounter similar warnings, ignore it and allow the application installation. Once you have installed the app, open it and grant the required permissions. When giving the location access permission in Settings, make sure to select Allow all the time to get location tracking data permanently. Once you are done with granting access, you must enter the purchased license. Find your license in the License section of your user panel. Enter the license to see the application login page, since this is the first time you enter the application, leave this field blank and select the Enter button to reach the Installation Guide Wizard. Attention! This installation guide is made for all standard devices. However, in case the installation guide is not displayed to you and the application crashes, don't worry. The application is activated for you. You must follow the post-installation steps. To learn more, refer to the tutorial video of post-installation actions, which is available in the training section. As shown in the video, give the required access to the application. To grant each access, look for the application's name, which is displayed in red color in the description section. In the first step, we give display over apps access to the application to allow it run in the background permanently. In the next step, we will be asked to disable Google Play Protect which we have done before installing the application according to this video tutorial. We will also carry out post-installation steps. Now we must disable the battery optimizer so that it does not stop the application from running in the background. Also put the app in the list of unoptimized applications. Continue to give the required access to the application according to the video. If you cannot find the application's name in the relevant section, look for it in subcategories such as downloaded applications or installed applications. Make sure that you have granted all the accesses correctly, otherwise the application logs will be inconclusive. Now you should enable screen capture access, select allow in the pop-up window. In this section, allow installing applications from unknown sources rather than Play Store. Now indicate the application installation purpose. If you are using services to monitor your employees, check the box. Note that your employees are notified in case you use the app for monitoring them. But if you, as a parent, intend to use any control to monitor your children under 18 years of age, you can uncheck this box to install the application in hidden mode. Please note that using any control requires accepting terms of use available on the Any Control website. In the last step, if you have done all the actions correctly, check them to complete the installation process. Now you should delete the installation file and grant the device admin access to the app. To do so, we first delete the app file from the file manager. And then by referring to the path where you see the video, we activate the device admin access for the application. Congratulations! The setup process has been successfully completed and you can now monitor the target device by referring to your control panel in any control. As you can see, my device logs are displayed in real time in my control panel. In order to avoid any potential issue in the logging process, we suggest that you also perform the post-installation steps. 
If you are satisfied with our features, kindly introduce any control to your friends and colleagues. If you need to test the application, contact customer support to get a 24-hour demo license. Thank you for choosing any control and staying tuned with us.